Uh, now, Manchester United moving on now. Uh, United in crisis, a lot of people say, but they're going to stand by the manager. Massive two games coming up, Robert. You know, this Fulham away is not easy. Uh, the Cottage, I, I used to love playing there. Love playing there. Famous old ground. And then they go to Copenhagen. Is this... T- is, are these two games does this determine Ten Hag's future in the Premier do you think or are they going to give him time every time I see over the last few weeks I think he's feeling the pressure every, every single time I see him coming out it's like a plea to the fans to give me time um, but as you know you need to get results and you know results have been have been shocking so uh, yeah. I think it is a vital time it's uh, those two games coming up where I think you know, if if he loses those two games, I think you can definitely see a change of manager. In my opinion, there's no there's no easy games now, do is there? Not you know, like in the Premier League, maybe in, in previous years you'd have teams where you know, are oh, we going to beat these? Now maybe you look at Luton, Sheffield United, but look at Fulham, Forest, Everton, Palace, Wolves, Brentford, West Ham. There's no easy games, is there? Even Fulham at home for Manchester United before would have been, oh, we'll go and get three points. You know, who's going to score today? You know, Ronaldo, Rooney. Do you know, feel though, oh, Gab, see when we used to play against United, in, in the sort of the tunnel, you, you would feel fear because you'd think, you know, we'd be lucky to get a result against them today. But then now teams are actually expected to go and beat Man United. They've just lost that, you know, that fear factor. Yeah, really. when I played, we had that Anfield. It was like, oh no, Liverpool, what yeah. way? But that was the only place. Uh, Arsenal was hard, Highbury. But Anfield was murder, honestly. You felt you, everyone yes. was against you there. But but a plus a great side. Well, that's what Liverpool. it was like at them teams. You'd, you'd be, what, what not study says, you'd be in the tunnel and you'd be thinking, OK, the game plan, don't forget the game plan. Everyone stay back. Yeah. <laughs> I'd play as a striker on my own. You'd be like, I'd be on the deepest midfielder. Forget the centre-halves. Now teams are going to Manchester United and be like, all right, everyone press forward. Yeah. I think a lot of teams in the Premier League are like that. They're so expansive. Brighton's, Brentford's, they're going to Old Trafford and popping them off the pitch, you know. Highest uh, possession stats mm-hmm. and, you know, they've got more shots than Man United. It's just, it just doesn't really feel the same now. No. But they're definitely underperforming. Even Bruno Fernandes, look, we know he can play, he can score a goal, but he, he looks a shadow of the player that we've seen him. You know, it's just amazing. Confidence. Confidence is a big factor in football, isn't it? When you When you're flying, you can't wait for the next game. And when you're not when you're not confident, you're out of touch. You're missing chances. You're thinking that's a hard game coming up. It's amazing mentally what it can do to you. And United at the moment are all over the shop. Yeah, do you know? Think um, now they're playing as I say the results and they're that going through that sort of period where you know they can't blame Harry Maguire anymore. You know, no, yes. I think every single time. There was something you just blame blame the 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 lads, you know. He's easy easy target every single time. Um, and I've played with Harry Maguire. Harry Maguire's a, a top player. Yeah. And he's um, but his confidence is shot to bits. Um, but the good thing is, it's it's not a good thing for the club, but it's a good thing for Harry that you know he's not the the, the sort of blame game anymore. Yeah, correct. Talk Sport Breakfast with Alan Brazil. Thursday and Friday morning, 6 till 10. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.